Yo, it's a lion's war, and the stakes are high. Lord Shadow steps up, he's ready to fly. Questions in the air, they start to rain. Can Lord clear his lane without any strain? How many deaths will Lord give out this war? He gotta maintain. Find the best counter for the fender. Lord Shadow skill, he's the ultimate contender. Maps laid out, it's a treacherous path. But Lord's got the skills, he's done the math. Checking the nodes, planning the attack. He's moving forward, there's no turning back. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 51, and this is war number nine. And we're going up against an alliance called Hell's Kitchen. All right. So we are still in tier three. So that means Corvus is not globally banned. So he's coming in. They've banned Hulkling, Mole Man, and Falcon. All right. Let's see who we got going on over here. Yep, there's our favorite. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So, looks like it's going to be Corvus, Proxima, and Magneto. And whoever I, ha uh, I have assigned to me, uh, as far as the minis go, let me look and see if he's already put up a plan. See. All right. Yep. I see a plan already set up. Let's see. Okay. So he has me bringing in Corvus, Proxima, and Human Torch. I do not like using Human Torch, so I'm going to um talk to him about that my human torch is rank four i run the ouchies so um human torch is usually not a good idea let me see who he has me assigned that human torch so um infinity um iron man infinity war is corvus okay electro corvus yep corvus can do that no problem um now, he has Ant-Man Future as Corvus. Corvus does not do that fight well. He definitely does not. Um, I, I will not go into that fight with Corvus. Um, that's a Magneto fight. And Lady Deathstrike can be Corvus. So, basically, instead of Human Torch, we're going to go in with um, Magneto. And that will clear my path. Now, let me see what he has for me as far as... Okay, yeah, see? Um, he has me fighting uh, Sassy with Human Torch. I was assigned to that before. And it did not work out well. In fact, I got stopped. Um, I did Flame On. I fought him. It didn't go well. And then I was there without... Human Torch, Flame On, and someone else had to come and back me up. So that's not a good idea. Uh, let me see. With the team that I'm thinking of going in with. Um, let me see, because this one. Yeah, see, because we're in Tier 3, it's not High Energy Diet. So I could take that Atuma with Corvus if I wanted to. It'd be a little dicey, though. Uh, let me see. Is there anybody else? Um, hmm. Dust could do it, but... I mean, uh, Corvus could do it, but I don't like going into this node that has power snack with cosmic champions because they tend to get buffs. And this is the fight that he wants me to do. And I mean, it's not that human torch can't do it. 
This is a great fight for Human Torch. I just don't seem to be able to do it very well. And not to mention, um, I will not use Corvus to fight that Ant-Man. So I need Magneto in there for that. And uh, so, yeah, that's not that's just not a good fight for me. Um, let's see. All right. So this fight here I could do with Corvus. She is annoying, though, for sure. But Corvus can do that fight. Um, let's see. And there we have the boss who, before that um, <clears throat> incident, I would have said, yeah, let me take that boss. But if they have inequity, then Corvus becomes not so great at that fight. Um, there's better options. He can still do the fight, but there are better options. So I'll I'll leave that uh, to someone else. Let me see. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Rank three. Wow, Sig one hundred onslaught, huh? Yeah, I'll leave that to the better counters. So honestly, with the team that I'm planning on going in with, mainly it's the team that I you know that he assigned me just without Human Torch. Magneto instead, uh, I can take that Jessica Jones and um, I'm trying to think, is there anyone else? I think that's pretty much it. Um, Photon, no. I, this node really needs somebody that can deal with that regen. So of these minis here, I would say um, Jessica Jones. And this fight here, I think someone else is going to do it. Um, Corvus can do that, but it's a not a fun fight. You got to really parry his um, special to uh, armor break him. And so that you don't get the stun reflected. And uh, then go to town, but eh, that's a that's an ugly fight. All right, let's get on with the fighting. So I'm going in with the dream team: Corvus, Proxima, and Magneto. Honestly, I probably need Proxima less than I think. You know, as long as I fight them while they are stunned. They're not going to evade or block while they're stunned. But Proxima makes um, makes the fights very, very easy when you're going up against a House of Mirrors uh, defender. Don't have to worry about any of that. Don't have to worry about clarity charges. Don't have to worry about them auto-blocking or evading. And sometimes they like to put uh, a defender that has their own auto-block and evade and when they do that it doesn't matter i get true strike we're good all right so the first fight is going to be against this uh iron man infinity war you see the auto block is up i need him to auto block here okay that's why you saw me wait just now and then i got hit but that's all right that's why i did the uh invulnerability boost all right and I don't want to kill him by mistake, because I will. All right, so I'm trying to get him. Trying to get him. Come on. All right, here we go. Try, come on, evade. Do something. You know, now he has the evade up. He don't want to evade. All right, now he finally did an auto block. But guess what? I'm going to kill him. I was like, oh, man. Really? However... This gives Corvus some nice charges. Even though I didn't get the auto block and the true strike there, 
I did get uh, two charges, I believe, um, for defeating a tech. And I believe uh, Iron Man Infinity War is uh, an Avenger as well. Now, this fight, when I used to see people put Electro into uh, war, I used to get upset because I'm like, they just want to drain us. That's all they want to do. Because look at this. I'm going to take him out, but look at my health. You know? And so it's like you're going to have to use items. But that tactic doesn't work these days because Kabam in the store lowered the price. We have better um, potions. And they don't get as expensive as they have in the past. So, I don't mind. We'll just get them down quick like that, and I'll heal up. No big deal. We're getting uh, enough loyalty that, you know, I'm not going to get drained. Now, anytime I see this guy here, uh, future Ant-Man, I always bring Magneto. However, I don't have to. If they banned Magneto and I saw him there, I'll bring Gladiator. If they ban Gladiator and Magneto, there's always a Cosmic Ghost Rider. You know, so we've got options. It's not a big deal. Um, but this is a pretty straightforward fight. You see that I'm starting to hold my um, heavy a little bit longer so that I can get more uh, prowess because I see that I'm getting closer to the special three. Okay? And I want to have a nice, juicy special three. Okay, we got 40 prowess. Okay. Here we go. Bam. And it's over with. Even if he had more health than he has right now, it wouldn't matter. Look at this. He didn't even survive the special. After the special, you get that shrapnel. And he wouldn't have survived that. Uh, I wonder, even at full health, would he be able to survive a 40 prowess special three from Magneto? I don't know. I don't think so. All right. And like I said, we get to heal up. And you'll see what I mean here. See, they're not that expensive. You still want to, you know, be efficient and not just, you know, use up all of your uh, heals uh, every war. But it's not as expensive as it was. Uh, you'll see here as I uh, grab some, I always forget to do this before the, the war uh, when I'm low. But look at this. See how much the level fives? I don't think we had level fives. Um, so I can grab the level fives. I could grab the level fours. And you'll see their, their cost doesn't increase. So I'm good. I'm good with this. Now, fighting uh, Lady Deathstrike can be tricky. One of the things that you want to remember about fighting her, you don't really want to hit her with a special one and a two because she'll heal it unless you do so much damage that you're going to take her out. So, like, if she was really low in health, I could fire a special two from Corvus and take her out. But as you can see here, there's not really any need to do that. And she's not going to survive for me to get to a special two. Anyway, this Corvus is by it. Seven star rank three Corvus. There is a reason he is globally banned in the higher tiers. All right. So that was my um, section one and section two paths. And now we're going to deal with a mini. Now, I told him he had me originally assigned to that Sasquatch down there. And I told him I'm not the one to do that. That that somebody else can do that. I don't do too well. I even sent him a video of what happened the last time I went up against that Sasquatch with my human torch. So he went ahead and took that. But then I noticed he had not reassigned me to another mini. 
And so when I got here, I was like, am I going to be fighting any mini? And he said, what mini do you think you can uh, do with your team? And I said, I could probably take that Jessica Jones. He said, all right, go for it. He's very, very supportive. You know, if you think you can do it, you know, go for it, you know? And then if I don't do it, we'll reevaluate it then. And I probably won't try to do it again if I can't do it. But just look at this. Just slicing and dicing, right? Now, my plan kind of went a little bit awry uh, right about here. Now she's unstoppable and I'm in the corner. And I'm like, what in the world? And you see the indestructibles. So I'm like, all right, all right. There we go, I waited it out. Get that special two, done. Even though she was unstoppable, unstoppable don't mean you don't take any damage. And his special two is unblockable. All right, so we did it. We'll be back and you'll see how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we lost this war and it was a nail biter. Look at the, uh, the score. We lost by one attack bonus. Well, um, let me see, fight duration. They probably still would have got us, so we would have needed, well, no, no. Man, this is always confusing to me, but it looks like we had the lower fight duration, so had we gotten that one extra attack bonus, we would have won on fight duration. Let me know in the comments below if I read that right, or is it the reverse? Kind of how we look at the defender kills. Uh, but anyway, that is going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol In the fight, he's swift, his tactics be tight Those shadows in the arena, ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned In the world of Marvel, Lord, the king crown